Hey guys, look, your guy is back. Hey, so to continue our holiday buyer's guide, I'm gonna go and kind of lead you guys from now through the holidays of, of all the stuff that you guys can buy for the holidays. Today I'm gonna cover seats. You guys are going, you know what, you got, hey, food, you done seats. I'm gonna get a little bit more simplified. So the seat buyer's guide, guys, there are different seats. There is a pivotal seat that uses a pivotal post that uses a pivotal system. Notice the ratchet system and the simple bolt that goes right in the middle and tighten that, okay? There is also the traditional rail seat, seat post. You guys are familiar with this, right? Unscrew this, this thing opens up, and then a seat like this, oh, it's going to bolt into that. That's a rail seat post. Rail seat, rail seat post. Or it also comes in a version like this, where you unscrew and just lifts up. This is a shadow one. Same thing, it bolts up. This looks slightly different, but you guys can see where it works. See the, where the rail goes in? But guys, there's also this one. See, this is a fixed seat post. So now, I'm going to show you a bike, okay? This is where I'm gonna get at. Let's go over here. Don't mind that. What? Don't mind that. Trying to get it here, Bob. Okay, guys. So, what we have here is a Coke Gateway. Why am I using this? Because this has happened to be one of our best selling bikes. A lot of you guys are going to get this for Christmas. But, guys, some of you guys are going to notice hey, you know what? I see a lot of cool seats over here. Oh man, I like I like the Vans one, I like the Merit one, I like the, the demolition and all that, but guess what guys? Unfortunately, this is where this buyer guide is gonna come in. <laughs> if you look at the seat, the gateway is a great bike, but the seat itself is a fixed seat. What is it again? This is a fixed seat. It's a seat with a seat post that is connected. So unfortunately, if you want to get a seat with all the cool design, you have to get the seat and the seat post. This is not gonna work. If you're gonna get a bike like this and you want one of those, this is what you need to do. So again, that bike comes with a seat similar to this. It's fixed. So, let's assume. Alf, let's, let's role play. You're that kid. Pick a seat, kid. Ah, the corduroys. Okay, you like the retro stuff. Oh, I want this, Mr. Cool. This is a great seat. Oh, you know what, kid? Unfortunately, you can't use this seat. Ugh. It has a pivotal system. Look at this ratchet system. Remember why I told you guys the different type of seat? Why, mister? Because you got a fixed post. So there's no way to get this out. Okay. Well, what I need to do? You need to get yourself a pivotal post. This thing, see how it has that? You need that. Oh, okay, no problem. Okay, well, the seat itself, the seat itself and the post have to go together. You can't just get a post and then not a seat. Remember, you're getting rid of a seat and seat post, so you have to get that. Okay, cool. I understand that now, everybody agrees on it. You need a pivotal seat and a pivotal seat post. Well, you know, I want something comfy. Here's the problem that everybody has. You know what, they sit there and they squeeze. They squeeze out, I want something comfy. You know what, I heard the Prima one's comfortable. I heard the Colt one's comfortable. But guys, what you guys notice is, look, this one here is a Mission brand. This one here is a Primo brand. Could you guys point out the difference? There is no difference. It's identical. So when you guys said, hey, I heard this one's more comfortable than not, you know what it actually really is? It's the material on top. This is, this is plastic almost. This is cloth. So a lot of people sit there and they squeeze it. They squeeze it and go, oh, but guess what, guys? Yes, if you get the plastic one, it will be a little bit firmer than the cloth. But when you guys are going, oh, you know what? The Snafu, the Odyssey, the more, no. What it is is that cloth material. And guys, 
keep in mind also, it's just like a lot of the stuff you guys have, the more you use it, the more it wears in, it's going to get softer. So you guys sitting there going, oh man, this is hard. It is hard right now, but after a while, it will break in and it will be softer. Oh, but you know, it's, you know, I heard that again, guys, I cannot stress enough. They're all made the same. They're all made the same. Everybody goes along with me. They're all made the same. Look, I could pull. I could pull seat after seat. Yeah, that's Animal a little different. One. That's a little Animal different. <laughs> you know, this. All these, they're all made the same. So they're all going to have the same surface area. The comfort part is the wear and tear. So now you guys have to decide. You guys have to decide the seat post itself. Okay, so now you guys have, you guys say I want a pivotal. I want to get that. Fine. Oh, dude, there is a cool seat. Oh, I love that. Look at. It. Well, pivotal post is not gonna work. So what do I do? That's where no problem. You get a rail seat post. And there. And <laughs> yeah. Uh, so the rail seat post is what you want with this. But guys, well I like this system, it's so clean. It's so clean. Unfortunately, in a perfect world, it's not going to work. Now, s and made this little cool little thing of a majigger. It uses a rail gut that holds it, but it goes into a pivotal. If you guys you know, get your hand on one of these, we'll hey Chris things. Moeller, make, uh, me, make me. Damn you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, did you just curse? No, oh man, you're, hey, you're grounded. You're not supposed to be cursing. Isn't that that kid that looks like that other kid that bumped his head? No, that one's totally different. Oh, okay. But I swear, dude, all, the, all the Asians, they look the same. Mm. Man, that's crazy. So hey Chris, Chris Moeller, make more of these. Guys, if you could get your hand on one of these, which is really rare, then you could use a pivotal post. And you could use a rail. Rail. Pivotal post. How do you tighten it? Um, it's very hard. <laughs> it's very hard. How do you, how do you tighten it? Very hard. You gotta put an you gotta put an Allen key. You gotta squeeze Fun's an out. Allen key. Yes, yes. So I'm just saying, there's that. But that's why it's better if you just use a rail seat post. This type or this type. What, what is this? But Foo, this shop has everything. Why don't you have any tripod ones? Why don't I use tripod? You're absolutely right. Tripod's whack. <laughs> sorry, whoever invented tripod, sorry. What is a tripod post? What is a tripod post? Oh, here we go. Tripod post. So we have one here. Guys, if you look at how the tripod post is, you're like, dude, what the? Where's the, uh, what? Well, the way the tripod seat posts work is you just don't buy one. <laughs> That's just sim simply it. it. You know what, guys? It works, but it's just nobody uses it. There's no adjustability. I'm not going to even talk about it. Okay? So, yeah, that's the way you use one is you just don't. Okay, I'm sorry all you tripod people. There's a stealth. Uh, I, I, I'm sorry too, the pivotal post is the way to go. It's way more versatile. There's way more options in seats when it goes pivotal, okay? So back to what I was talking about. <laughs> the next thing you want to determine when in our buyer's guide when you want a new seat for your bike that does not come with a seat and seat post is what size seat post. Seat post itself, if you guys look at the bottom of the post, right here, that must be just my shine. That's just me, my shine. But you see the 27.2? That tells you that the diameter of this, like this post right here, right here guys, 25.4. That is a typical BMX size so that's what you have to determine hey i want a 27.2 hey i want a 25.4 see even this 
25.4. They all have that number. So if you guys aren't sure, bring in the seat post and go, I need one that size. So, um, uh, should be good. Again, guys, this is a very quick crash course. It's basically to guide you to, to buy a seat because a lot of you guys can get bikes and some of the parents are going to go, I want to kind of spruce up that bike because it comes with a black seat. You guys know this. Turn around, turn around now. I'll turn around. Look, look at all the seats. Look at all the seats. All the bikes come with black seat, black seat, black seat everywhere. Where? Come on. I mean, black is cool, but. Clearly a brown you one. You know, right look at this. Checker, camo, you know. So, guys, if you want to get a more spiced up seat, Pivotal Post is the way to go. A pivotal system is the way to go. But if you want the rail stuff, that's fine. It's a little bit more comfy. You've got these right here. That's, mm, yes. But they all use a rail. Oh, wait, look at that. What is that? Guys, this is a rail system too, but this is right here. It's a traditional gut. See the seat post? Go right in and you can tighten that stuff. But none of the guys on a BMX bike is going to use that. They're going to use a pivotal and a pivotal system. I hope that helped you guys. I know that sounds a little confusing, but if you guys are a little confused, again, guys, comment in so I could read it, so I could make sure, oh, you know what, Fu? I need to go and I need to slow down. I need to get more detail. You guys help me help you, okay? I'm out, guys. Subscribe, like, dislike. Um, anything, hey, anything else? Uh, I don't know, you guys. Okay, I'm out.